Yo, we're the couple, and we are at Tokyo Disney Sea in Japan. Uh, if we look a little different, we're using our tiny camera yeah. because uh, you don't want to be hauling around a giant camera backpack around a place like uh, Tokyo Disney Sea. We woke up at 5 a.m. The transfer at Tokyo Station was rough, but we're here in line. It's a few minutes before the park opens. We get in, we rush over and get some fast passes for Tower Terror. Head over to Journey 7 Zero. From there, we'll see what happens, whatever. right? <laughs> so come join us. Let's go. All right, Brittany, what's going on? We're going to Tower. Yeah, we just got in. We got stuck in the bag check line for forever. That was something that took forever. The, the tickets were easy. It was crazy. Ticket line was like five, six minutes, really. But the bag check, look, look so long. Tons of people all heading over for tower, but oh man, look at that view. It's a very gray, rainy day. But we're happy to be in here finally. Yeah. You'll we'll have plenty of time to rest when we're standing in line. Tower Terror has got a crazy wait normally. If you don't get just how popular this ride is here at Disney Sea. This is the line just for the fast pass. This is the line to get a fast pass at 8.30 in the morning. The return time is not as early as we'd hoped for, but it's okay. We'll make it work. We're heading towards the mysterious island. Ah, not as bad of a walk as I thought it would be. Hopefully the line's not going to be too long for Journey. Well, our app right now says it's about 90 minutes. 90 minutes? Yeah. Whew. Look at this line. This isn't a 90 minute line. Ah. <laughs> uh, all right, well, we finally found the end of the standby line for our journey, and it is not 90 minutes, it is 140 minutes. Yeah, and by the time we walked over here, it probably added more. Probably. It's supposed to be one of the best rides here at Disney Sea, which is why it's so popular. Um, while Brittany was waiting in line, I picked up some snacks because we pretty much had a run to the station and everything. And uh, so we got a soda. This is the large. It's not that big. <laughs> we got a fried pizza turnover and it's got chicken and mozzarella inside. Give it a bite. Okay. That was all great. Oh. Well, that's unfortunate. <laughs> Did you actually get something not other than bread? <laughs> it's not stuffed a whole lot. The bread itself is pretty flavorful. Yeah. Oh yeah. Ah, nice. Yay! Yay, food! I just checked the wait time, and right now the wait time's 180 minutes. <laughs> over two hours of waiting. We're closing in on the front of the line. Can't really record this ride. It's very rough and tumble. And, uh, but uh, we'll let you know how it was right after, yeah? Yay! Journey was amazing. <laughs> it was pretty fun. <laughs> it was surprising, actually. <laughs> Don't want to give it away, but if you ever end up at Tokyo Disney Sea, yeah, it's worth the wait. Yeah. <laughs> Just probably get here even earlier than we did. Yeah, I, I would stand for three hours, but two hours is fine. Yeah, it's, not, it's, it's raining a lot, but... Oh, wait, um, that's the train. Hi. So it's pouring rain, but we made it over to Big Lateria. So there's a really popular show called Big Band Beat. So there's a really popular show. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> well. Freaking scumbag volcano. <laughs> Started well, erupting right erupted. when we, uh, yeah, you can see there the smoke like coming out. There was like fire and everything. It looked really cool. We almost got it for you, but not quite. Maybe, maybe if it goes off again later. Ruining all our takes. <laughs> we went over to Big Lataria. And it's for a really popular show called Big Band Beat. Yep. It's so popular that you actually have to get reserved tickets. They're free, but they're only available during a lottery raffle. Yep. Ha -ha. We got it! Maybe we didn't have so much good luck trying to get into the park earlier, <laughs> but we got tickets. We're gonna watch the show. 150. So you may have noticed that it's very wet here. 
and because we don't know where we are, we used our map, and this is the result. Wow, that's, uh, I think it's, it's just about done for. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're mostly doing stuff on this half, right? So. Oh, perfect, so just. All right, just, oh. don't, don't do that, it's coming oh. apart. <laughs> All right, so we bought some ears, <laughs> and uh, I think we can finally use our Tower of Terror fast passes, so uh, let's go. Let's go. It's a little different. Actually, it's it's really different. It's really different. The, it's really only got like the whole ride aspect. Yeah. So the actual like elevator like yeah, raise like and drop. Whole, like the actual ride is the same, but the story and everything else around it is totally different. Yeah. The theming is very similar to like Indiana Jones. It's like a mix between Indiana and Haunted Mansion. And yeah. the the ride is a lot more gentle. <laughs> The drop is very soft compared to what you used to at uh, California Adventure, yeah. but very okay. cool. We can't go on tower right now, so this is a good. This is the best is, we can get. This is the best we got. Fun. Yeah. Let's go get a snack. I'm Let's hungry. Let's go get food. Look at that tower. <laughs> While I was standing in line, Brittany picked up these cute little mochi guys. Mochi guys. The aliens from Toy Story. Yeah, they're they're really cute. <laughs> So cute, I almost don't want to eat them, but... Uh, I think it's... One is vanilla, one strawberry, and one's chocolate. Hopefully you get the chocolate one, right? Yeah. The big test. I think this one's chocolate. Look at it. Oh, gosh. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Oh, it's super cold. <laughs> ah, chocolate. I think it's chocolate. All right, give it a try. Chocolate? Yep. Mmm, it tastes like chocolate pudding. Ooh, fun. Good bomb. Not bad. So they're super cute and super tasty. How much were those? 360 yen. Oh, that's not too bad. Huh. Three bucks. Oh. Awesome. Pretty good. Well, I got the vanilla one, I think. Yeah, it looks like it. Kind of looks like vanilla, right? Yeah. I would put his face off. <laughs> yeah, that's vanilla. Like a custard. Yeah? Mm. Almost tastes like flan. Really? Mm. Pretty good. Oh, that one, that one's a little... That one almost looks like the vanilla one. Oh. That's definitely strawberry. Super strawberry. It's pretty. It's pretty strawberry. I just have to say that while we're to doing this, I smell the hot dogs, and it smells really, really good. We'll get a hot dog soon. Yep. Five, ten minutes. Yeah. Lines. <laughs> Lines. Tokyo Disney Resort. Yeah. Mochi's good though. Yep. Oh heck yes. Couldn't have just mochi because, quite frankly, it's getting into the afternoon. We haven't really had any real food. Nope. So uh, we grabbed a couple hot dogs. Ta da! You know, uh, so far, everything in Japan's been pretty small portions. <laughs> it's the first time we can say that the, the it's a little bigger than we expected. Wow. Huh. A little what? under four. Dang. Well, that's really good since the mochi was about three. No, it was a th 390 yen. Yeah. All right, let's eat this before it gets cold. All right. It's cold outside. <laughs> How's the taste? Tastes like a hot dog. All right. <laughs> I don't know how well that focused, but it looked really good. It is good. <laughs> that was pretty tasty, actually. Really? If you remember those big band beat tickets that we got, well, we just got out of that show. It was awesome. Yeah, it was really fun. It was basically a big stage production with a live band. Multi-piece live band yeah. and a lot of dancers and even Disney characters yep. getting up on stage and playing a lot of swing jazz music. Yeah. Very fun. Music, dancing, all that. Very energetic. Very, yeah. very fun. And surprisingly, like 99 to pretty much 100% English yeah. was he kind said, of surprising. Like, one phrase in, in Japanese. And that yeah, he, he just asked if uh, everyone was having fun in Japanese. Yeah. It was really cool, very enjoyable. If you get the chance to see it, highly recommend it. Yes, if, if you can win the lottery. If you can get in the lottery, which is, uh, well, we can't help you with that. No. But, uh, it was a great time. Yep. And we also got really nice seats too. We got the aisle seats. Yeah, it, come on, that is amazing. That was good. There was nobody in the way. <laughs> well, we went on Indy, and it was pretty cool. Yep. Pretty much the same as 
Indiana Jones at Anaheim Disneyland. Uh, just yeah. a little more mo modernized, I'd say. Basically the, the same track, but different... Special effects? Yes. Yeah, I, I was wondering about the lack of fire. Yeah. Until a certain part, which we won't spoil for you, but... Which was the best part, honestly. Pretty much made the entire ride yeah. for us. But, uh, yeah, pretty much what we expected, and that's not a bad thing. Oh, no. Like, if you like Indian Disneyland, like, I would spend the Fast Pass and go on this one. Definitely. Even if it's basically the same ride. Yeah. I wouldn't make it my first Fast Pass, but for us, being our second Fast Pass, yeah. definitely worth it. Yeah, Tower Tower first. Plus, it's like an over three-hour wait right now. For the standby line, yeah. which is not fun. No. So we're finally having a proper meal. Yep. Uh, we stopped at the Yucatan Base Grill, which is right next to Indiana Jones. Yep. They have a nice chef special set, so you get hamburger patty with some sauce on it, sausage. It looks like a thick cut of bacon. Yeah. Some rice, a potato. You also get some uh, bacon and vegetable soup. You get a chocolate mousse for dessert, and you get a soda. Oh. Because it's the 15th anniversary, we decided to also get the 15th anniversary chocolate cake with the souvenir plate. Because look at that plate, it's super cute. I don't know about you, but I got this burger. <laughs> I'm really looking forward to seeing how good this all is. So, uh... And the best part about it, it's not a lot. Wait, there's like a bunch of empty tables. We, we seriously... we go somewhere to go eat, there's like a line out the door. It's, it's crazy. Fun. Yeah, even like the regular snack stands, the hot dog place, popcorn places. Yeah. That's crazy. But here we literally walked up, bought our food, brought back, no fighting for tables. No, no. That so is... I don't, I don't care what we eat here, I'm eating here. <laughs> well, let's dig in, yeah? Yeah. Anyway, we're gonna head over to 20,000 Leagues under the sea. We're gonna finish eating and we got Really, really quick fast passes for that one. Yep. So why not, right? Yep. So let's go. Let's go! At Tokyo Disney Sea, Tokyo Disneyland, one of the big things to do is to get popcorn. Yep. But even cooler than that, you can get a cool popcorn bucket. We had to, and it has to be Duffy. It has to be Duffy because Duffy is, again, Tokyo Disney Sea's mascot. Plus, this is the cutest one we've seen so far. It is adorable. Let's be honest, that is, that is super cute. Ta da! And it's filled with milk chocolate popcorn. How is it? it? Tastes like chocolate and popcorn. That's not a bad thing. No, actually. <laughs> that'd be kind of weird. Hmm. Well, if you get like the curry popcorn or some of the other flavors in the park. Well, if we eat all this, maybe we'll get curry one. All right. Well, we went on 20,000 leagues under the sea and it was pretty good. We basically like walked on. Yeah. We waited like a minute in line. Thank you, Fast Pass. Yeah. <laughs> it's one of those easy rides. There was actually one point where it moved a little fast. But yeah, it was uh, a little fast. It's pretty cool though. Yeah. More, like a nice little break. I, mean, I wouldn't wait like an hour or more in line for it, but no. if you can fit into your schedule yeah. at Disney Sea, yeah. go for it. Definitely a little more unique than yeah, it's, the other it's rides. Definitely interesting. Ah, let's go check out the Arabian Coast. Let's go! He's super cute. Oh, he's super expensive. How much? 36. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yep. Roll a little more. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, way harder. Yeah. Oh. Oh, really hard. Oh, so close. Okay. Okay. Roll it hard. A little ball rolling game, and uh, unfortunately, we didn't win. That was really terrible. It was, uh, it was tough. It's a lot harder than it looked. 
The balls are pretty heavy and they... That was cool. It was random. I didn't yeah. know they had anything like that here. Even though you don't win the big plush, yeah. you still get a consolation prize, which is... We got pin! You get to choose a pin! Not bad, huh? So we got Chandu and we got Mini. Very cool. They're super cute. They are super duper cute. And that, that's nice because at least, you know, even though it's a lot, it was 500 yen per yeah, person. 500 yen per, per play. Yeah, yeah. But uh, you get something out of it. Yeah. I mean, it's a Disney pin, yeah. so can't really complain and about that. It would huh? probably cost you at least five bucks for these pins anyways. Most likely, yeah. yeah. Uh, it would have been so cool though. We're at the Mermaid Lagoon, and uh, it's getting a little later in the night, so I don't know if we're really going to have time to ride anything, but I figured we'd at least stop in and see how cool it looks. So this is a really cool statue of Triton, but what's interesting is this is right at the front. You can actually look straight down. We went on the Whirlpool. It's basically... Lazy like man's teacups. Very lazy teacups. You can't spin them to make them go faster, but they do spin they do a fair amount on their own, so yeah. that's cool. Plus my arms aren't all tired. Yeah. So afterwards decided to treat ourselves with a little snack. It's a Mickey Ice Bar. Tropical fruit flavor. It's probably mango, your favorite, Brittany. It smells like pineapple. Oh. Not my other favorite. It's not bad, actually. Kind of like a fruit punch. That's pretty good. 310 yen? Yeah. Not too bad. I mean... It's a giant. It is a lot bigger than I thought it would be. Regardless of what day, it's going to be crazy because everyone comes early. Yeah. Get the big rides out of the way. The food will be here. <laughs> Just eat some food. Well, it's the day after. Tokyo Disney Sea. Yeah. Uh, we were pretty busted up, so we couldn't really film an outro there. Plus, it was really dark too. It was dark, and Lots we were just we and, uh, just got exhausted. Yeah, it was. Uh, it was. It was a long day. Yeah. Very but, long day. But well, it doesn't help that we've been walking around the past like five days. Yeah, and I mean, right before that too, we were at a uh, UFO day. catcher every day. The entire day. Disney Sea was a lot of fun. Yeah, uh, the, it's it's really cool. It still, uh, it still feels very Disney. Although mm -hmm. it's a little different. It's supposed to be like the analog to uh, California Adventure. Yeah, it's so different from California Adventure. And oh, honestly, yeah. I it's I like, just... I really like Disney Sea way more than California Adventure oh, ever. It's so much more to do, and the theming is really cool. I think overall it feels more complete. Yeah. I, I definitely wouldn't just go to California Adventure, whereas you can go to just Disney Sea and the still not... Day. Yeah. Just... There's just like so much to do. You couldn't possibly fit it all in. And it's all like really good stuff mm -hmm. too. The main downside of Disney Sea is we went on a, a weekday. We went on a Tuesday. We went on a Tuesday morning. We got up early. We got there quite a bit before the park opened, but mm -hmm. it's the, always busy it's and it's always, always crowded. crowded and the lines even, are always long. Even like the snack trucks, what are the, is that what they are? Yeah, like the, 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 the snack wagons and wagons. stands. Yeah, yeah the, the lines were crazy. Like you're just getting like, what, a churro. So it was weird because towards the afternoon around 5, ish 5 30 mm -hmm. the lines for all the food stuff well besides those little snack stands there wasn't nobody there yeah it was so they were off. fine like it was it was weird because that's how we got our like big lunch 
each ride will have a two hour wait minimum. Yeah, and this at is least on the two Tuesday. Hours. Yeah. And so Tuesday and Wednesday are the emptiest days and I, I don't wanna know what it's like on a Friday, Saturday or no. Sunday. So never go on the weekend unless you absolutely have unless to. Unless you have to yeah. And you don't mind only going on one ride the entire day. <laughs> It was it really, was really cool. Yeah. I mean, aside from just the attractions, which some of them were very familiar, but they had a very different feel to them. Oh, like yeah. Tower and Indy. Indy you know, it, it, there's a lot of unique <laughs> stuff there, too. Yeah. And there's a lot of variety in the different lands, mm -hmm. which, is, which is pretty nice. So on the map, in the different lands, mm -hmm. it shows like a cutoff. So like this land's flooring is red, and then this land's flooring is like brown. Yeah. Actually, in real life, the flooring changes, so you know exactly which land you're actually going into. <laughs> yeah, that was a really yeah. nice touch. It's it's pretty hard to get lost there. Yeah. And it's it's easier to get around. Probably should have put more space inside the shops, because the shops <laughs> so the strange. shops got really crowded. And it, the the thing with there though too is that the shops don't just get really crowded at the end of the day. The shops were crowded all day yeah we went in the morning we went in the, the like early afternoon we went at night and they didn't okay yeah. <laughs> it was a little more crowded at the very end of the day but it was still crowded true the whole time don't don't let the whole crowd thing get in the way too much because like we said it's always going to be busy yeah so just manage your time right i mean we got what like three fast passes yeah we still got three fast <coughs> passes quite easily went on a lot of rides yeah the hardest part was just waiting for journey at the beginning really yeah but there wasn't any other good time to do it because as the day went on it was going to well over three hours yeah oh uh, we wish it could have gone to tokyo disneyland too but no time next time uh, next time let's go back to japan like Next month. Oh, okay, no, I need a break. Okay, fine. I'm tired. We obviously we had to buy some stuff because it's Disneyland. So first up, we've got the the Duffy and Shelly May ears. You saw them on our heads during half of the vlog. Yep. Pretty cool, right? We got popcorn bucket. We got the Duffy popcorn bucket because it was super cute. And yeah. the milk chocolate popcorn was pretty good too, right? Yeah, it was pretty good, actually. Yeah, I liked it. I wish you could have gotten more flavors, but honestly, we were so full. Yeah, I wanted to get the curry one because it actually, like, legit smelled like curry. It seriously smells like curry being we made. We were so full. Oh, man. The thing that I had to get... Burger pouch. Burger pouch. It's a burger pouch. It don't hold a whole lot, but hey, it's a yeah. burger pouch. I mean, come on. <laughs> the little pins. The little pins from the, the mini carnival game, I guess that you call it. Yeah, that. it was so weird. Yeah. It was so random. It was like it, I don't think it was pointed out on the map anywhere, but we found it. We had to play it, because, you know, us. Next up, we've got Gelatoni. Look at him. He's the bigger plush. He's cool. He is so cute. He was not cheap, but he is no. adorable. He was worth every penny. And his hat actually his hat, clips on. Yeah, his hat is actually a clip. Mm -hmm. So it clips onto a little hook on top of his head so you can change out his hat. Because yes. they all have like outfits you can change. That is correct. But it's got an like, actual like, it's like a hair clip. So you can actually put his little hat on your head. Nice. And I might have to do that. Oh, can we talk about how when you buy something at anywhere in Japan, they'll actually tape it up for you. This so is true. So it doesn't like open up and like spill out everywhere. It's nice, unless you actually need to grab something out of the bag. It's really, <laughs> it's really cool, unless you actually need stuff that's in the bag. So I got Mickey. 15th anniversary Mickey. Yeah, so it's cute. Because uh, it's Disney Sea's anniversary, and actually the anniversary ends in like the 17th, I think? Yeah. Definitely had to get at least something that's 15 related. I got this headband. Shashark. 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 Ta-da. Kitty headband. Kitty headband. That's awesome. I got this. It's like totally not Disney Sea related at all, <laughs> but what it's like it? a Rapunzel fascinator. Hmm. Yeah, it's like a hair clip in the back. It's and nice. You just clip it on. I like it. This 15 anniversary plate. Yeah, that's from the from chocolate our cake. Cake. At a uh, Yucatan base camp. Which actually didn't really taste like chocolate. Yeah, it was a really light chocolate chocolate cake, but not even light. Like there's no chocolate taste. It's Japan, you know, it's the stuff's just not gonna be super sweet. But the plate's really cute though. Yeah. And then we also got oh! That looks familiar. <laughs> Real familiar. We both got one. Yeah, I had to get one too. Cause yeah. souvenirs. Yeah. And then Joyce didn't get a giant gelatoni like I did. 
so he got a tiny one. A baby size one. But he's got cute overalls on. Oh, and his bow tie too. Yeah. Oh, he's cute. If there was a big one that had the outfit, I would have bought that. I probably would have bought him. Yeah. Either, honestly. <laughs> we also got... The most American bow tie you'll ever find. <laughs> Especially in Tokyo, what? Yeah, I don't understand why that's really a Tokyo Disney scene, but here it's we are! Giant American bow tie. America. Do I hear a uh, Dapper Day? <laughs> Gonna have to think up a good outfit for that. Yeah, we got these! Stitch glasses! Yeah, they, they actually are that gigantic. Yeah. They're awesome. That's your scale. That's all we got. That's it! Yep. That was, it was a pretty good it's haul. Good amount of stuff. We had to, uh, we had to hold back a little bit because, uh, it's already expensive. That's like, what, 7,400 yen per person to get in for a day? Yep. And then food, food. and then everything else, the train ride, oh. but. It was worth it. That was a pretty great first experience at a Tokyo Disney Resort. Yep. Yeah, hopefully you guys had fun watching this too. Yeah. Again, we are the Pink Couple. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, let us know what you think about our video and the whole Crane Couple in Japan video series. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of other videos from Japan that we'll be putting up. Yep. And uh, we'll see you next time. Bye. <laughs> He's so cute. <laughs>